what's up YouTube this is Mike I'm back with another video today uh, we're gonna be doing the oil filter recharge on a Cobb system um, I have the K&N cleaner kit should be the same um, so we'll just dive right into it I'll show you the footage that I got and uh, hopefully you enjoy it and hopefully this helps you all right as well as the uh, oil and checking for the the leak we're also going to take off his air box here he's got a fancy one what is this i don't know i didn't put it it's the cob the cob one so we're going to clean out his filter uh, apparently when you do this fancy filter you got to take this little box off so that's what he's working on right now uh i'm not gonna i'm not gonna say how long he said it's been since he's cleaned this but uh it's been a little while so we'll get it cleaned up while we're waiting for this to cool off and put it all back together all right so we're going to use my K&N uh, cleaning kit it's uh, a recharge kit for these it's essentially the same idea with this one so the first thing you do is you just kind of bang out all the big debris and then we're going to use the spray cleaner on it and then we use a soft bristle brush to just clean it all out so tooth fresh toothbrush It does look better. That's probably good. All right, and just scrub, scrub it up, and it will save you from having to watch us do this for quite a while. But that's that's all he's got to do. Just scrub it until it's clean. Right, so the only thing we got to do now, the lighting really sucks over here. I'll just keep going. We should be able to see it in the white sink. Um, you just got to rinse it out. So we sprayed the cleaner on it. You scrubbed the outside. Do you need something different? Do you want me to give my phone camera the light? Uh, no, we'll just run it. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. I'm pretty sure you'll see. So we brushed the outside of this. So you'll want to wash it from the inside out with the water. So, oh man, you can see, see all that coming off of it. That stuff works great. And I don't know if I mentioned in the previous clip, when you spray that stuff on, you want to use a soft bristle brush. So we grab a toothbrush. I can't quite remember if I said that in the previous statement. It already looks way better. Alright, we'll try it from here, I guess. Alright, so this is the stuff that you charge it with. Uh, we already did one coat. I just have to kind of go back over it and hit us, hit any of the spots that I may have missed. I, I think we noticed one. So, where was it? Oh, right there, right here. So, you just shake up the can a little bit. And it's supposed to just be one pass. It's aerosol spray. And that's it. I'm going to spin it and see if maybe there's any more spots. I think we're good. So now that this has all been <clears throat> cleaned, oiled, you can go back in the car. Um, it says you got to wait about 10 minutes. And we did. We waited quite a while. Just that last little bit we had to hit. So put it back in the car. And uh, we'll get this thing fired up. All right, so the car's all put back together. That was the uh, 27, 2017 Subaru WRX uh, with the Cobb air filter uh, recharge kit. Uh, it's been about two weeks since we did that job, and um, the reason I waited a little while because I was curious to find out about um, if it would improve his MPGs on that car, and uh, Tom was telling me that he, he improved his MPGs by over three by that everything that we did so it was oil oil change and the filter cleaning but I don't think that it really improved much of his gas mileage from the oil I think it was actually cleaning that filter and getting it uh, ready to go again um, so uh, I'm gonna test this theory on my car too um, I've been tracking the, the MPGs on my car I'm gonna switch to a, a K&N filter on mine and then see if there's that significant of a difference um, but Tom was telling me he got three and plus three improvement on his. 
So, hey, thank you for watching my videos. Uh, I appreciate every last subscriber. I did see that I just recently went over 200 subs, and I can't thank every single one of you enough. I thoroughly appreciate it. If you're new here, hit that subscribe button. If you're a returning viewer, uh, please, if there's anything that you want to see in the future, I would love to uh, try to dive into it and figure out what that is. All right, thank you for your time, and I'll catch you in the next one.